Hello, my friends. <laughs> my entourage full of rock stars and divas. Dropped out of school, but I live better than a teacher. Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Crab Lord back again. Today, we're gonna be doing how to sound like Lil Tracy in Demons. Sorry, I've been kind of lacking on videos. Um, just turned 21, had to enjoy the week. Also, I slept for like two hours today, so I might look a little uglier than normal, but that's part of the brand. I did drop a new song a couple days ago. Butterflies in my stomach got me like a wow. The mama won't you come and pull up on me right now? Go over to Apple Music, Spotify, Tidal, Napster, every single platform you can think of. Song's called Butterflies. Great tune, very heartwarming, uplifting. Go check it out if you're really about it. Anyway, before we get into the video, make sure to subscribe if you're not already subscribed, and the notification button as well, because I've been dropping videos very frequently. Not really. Also, check out my description. I got my music, my preset packs, which I'm going to be dropping very soon, maybe in my next video. My social media, Instagram, at Evan Helbling, Twitter, at Crablord, and Facebook, I don't even use. And all my equipment's down below as well, if you want to see what I use, my microphone, my interface. All that kind of stuff, you can check out those links. Anyway, let's get in the video. All right, y'all, look. Some people that come on these videos don't understand that I'm not trying to sound like the artist himself. I'm just trying to replicate the mixing style that certain song used. So you just have a bunch of different styles of mixing that are easy. There is a backup vocal, and I'll talk about that later. Once again, all my backup vocals I use are the same as the duplicated track. You add sample delay. This vocal effect, it's not very clean. Like, the song itself wasn't very clean. Here we go. My eyes are rushed full of rust as and divas Dropped out of school but I live better than a teacher I'm with a model, sip on wine out the bottle Paint you a picture with these words of Picasso I was eating and you was just tweeting I run it up because I'm being chased by demons I was eating and you was just tweeting I run it up because I'm being chased by demons I try to be more simple with this one. There's no buses used in this. That causes confusion sometimes. This is a simple, nice little vocal chain. So let's talk about what I did here. So right now I'm talking on a track with both EQs activated, and I'll turn them off. All right, so we're talking on that naked track. Now, what we have here, let's talk about this. First, we have pitch correction. And with pitch correction, I never keep it on because it delays me, but really just all pitch correction is is like the response time. The root all depends on your beat, but I have major scale G sharp for this song. Zero response time, so you can get that kind of Entourage full of my stars and diva, huh? Huh. But we talk about this every video, so who cares? Uh, next, we have a channel EQ. Uh, usually, my first EQ is very similar. Now, these EQs, there's way more in-depth ways to do it, but I'm doing like the shortcut easy way and th that I even use, and I think it sounds pretty good, but it could be better. I need to learn more, but... We take out the low end to about um, 134. I'm just ballparking it, 150's fine. Next, we have this little, like, we have this green guy right here. We dropped him down a little bit, and if you want the width to change, like, like I said in other videos, you just click the dot, and you can go to the size and... Get funky with it. But I have it about 0 0.3, as you can see at the bottom here. Next, the blue, I dropped it down 0 0.5 dB around here. I mean, you might not even have to do that. But then um, what really matters is lifting the high. The purple one around 2K, but lift it up 2 dB, so it's just covering the 5K, 10K, and 20K area. Feel free to call me out and tell me I'm wrong, because that's how we do it here. Uh, next, we have the compressor. I've been experimenting with different presets. The compressors don't do all that much, I don't think, but I'm in dynamics, compressor, and mono. Yeah, and you go into the compressor, right? You go into voice, and I click dance vocal. I, I like to use bright vocal. This time I tried dance. I uh, got dance vocal, boom. I didn't really change anything about that. Next, we have the pedals, which are my favorite. It gives it a more upfront and like a big cut through feel. So we have a basic squash on. I'm going to back up because it's kind of loud. Pedals are found easy. You just go to Amps and Pedals and go to Pedal Board. I'm in mono. I uh, do either one. I'm not smart enough to know the difference. All right, so we're going to compressor, right? Basic squash. Now, you just see the one squash compressor. It's one of the best. Honestly, the squash compressor is one of the best things in Logic. Disagree with me or not, I think it's one of the best things to use. We have the level at 9 dB, and we have the sustain at negative 23. Fast attack. Fast attack. Um, silver verb. Never used this before. It's a really clean reverb. So we're gonna find that as reverb, silver verb. But we're in mono to stereo. And all I did here was go to the preset hall. And I think I changed this. I have 100% dry, 15% wet. And then all these other settings try to be similar to it. I'm not sure if I really changed it. Maybe the size and moved down to 50. And that's that. And then we have the last channel EQ. So in the actual song, it was kind of like rugged. It had like a rugged sound to it. I raised up around the 2K area, dropped again around the 500, a little high and raised again. Just kind of a little slope like that. Green's down, yellow's up. I literally just started moving crap around and brought the yellow from all the way down here, but it's how it's done. And then also, whenever you want to make the backup track, you click the main track, you want to hit the command button and then D. That will copy the entire track down. Now because it's a backup track, you don't want it to mix exactly with it, so we give it a sample delay, which makes it go around. I'm gonna change it right now. So now it's on the sides, more full vocal, 
And the only difference between that one is um, I messed up with the channel EQ a lot. Gave with that big raise over here on the 2K. It's just a little more funky over here. You just gotta drop a sample delay. Left or right's not a big deal. I like around 600 to 800 is like what I like to have it at. Kinda has the same deal going on. If you go too high, it gets weird. All right, that's the explanation. All right, let's do a live recording. Do a little freestyle action, do some fun stuff. Let's get into it. Hello, my friends. <laughs> my entourage full of rock stars and divas. Dropped out of school, but I live better than a teacher. I'm with a model, sip on wine out the bottle. Paint you a picture with these words of Picasso. I was eating and you was just tweeting. I run it up because I'm being chased by demons. I was eating and you was just tweeting. I run it up because I'm being chased by demons. Only enjoy by some old demons, oh. Huh. My answer was full of rock stars and divas. I took your chicken and I'm under the bleachers. I'm sipping coffee out of this little Omnita. I'm 21, so I can drink alcohol now. Sip and wine up out of coffee cup. That's about it for me. Hope you guys enjoyed that video as well as enjoyed the ending performance. I try to be as magnificent as I possibly can. Just kidding. Anyway, make sure to like this video and drop a comment down below telling me what you think and who I should do next. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. Check out my new single Butterflies on Spotify and iTunes and every other thing, you know? You don't have to buy it. Just get a little stream action, all right? It's free on SoundCloud as well. This has been a crowd about how to sound like Lil Tracy in Demons. And like always, we out. I mean to brag, but they love my style They used to tell me leave, now I'm staying for a while Butterflies in my stomach got me like, oh, wow. La mama